All right, guys, this is probably going to be a pretty fast paced video here, but we have a 6.5 Grendel AR-15. It is built by yours truly. I will put the rifle specs in the description below because I don't really have the time to go over it, but essentially it's an arrow precision receiver set. We got an Odin barrel, Liberty suppressor on the end, Sons of Liberty Gunworks bolt carrier. Got an Athlon scope on top. I'm a really big fan of these with a Warren scope base and a hodgepodge of other parts. But anyway, we are going to try to go through this fairly quick because the sun is going down really fast and I'm trying to squeeze in one more video for you guys. Hopefully you can see the target, but I'm gonna go ahead and start shooting here. We got 105 grain Sierra bullet, their Blitz King, 25.0 to 27.5 grains of, of IMR 8208 XBR. That's gonna be the powder we're using for every cartridge here that we have loaded just uh moving up in half grain increments for the first three groups and then it's going to be 0.3 grain increments from there uh very new to this cartridge very new to this um cartridge in this platform i should say uh so we are just kind of being a little more cautious but um i had to get it sighted in using the first group it's kind of an accident but uh anyway we're gonna go ahead and get started here aiming at the top left diamond we're just going to move across and down on the paper so here goes 25.5 grains it's starline brass using remington seven and a half uh, bench rest primer I can't see the holes at all. I'm pretty sure they're heading to my point of aim. I just can't see them. So I'm hoping you guys can see target footage pretty good right now. Um, the GoPro, the newer GoPro that I'm using should be able to pick up the lower light stuff a little better. Gosh dang it, I knew that would happen. Uh, so anyway, I just, I really hope that you can see it, but I don't know how well it's gonna come up with this kind of lighting. We're gonna go ahead and shoot through these anyway. I just really didn't wanna do it when it got this dark, but I ran out of time and I'm, st I'm here. So we're gonna go ahead and do it. That group was with 26.0 grains of IMR 8208XBR. So we went up a half grain and a half grain. Now we're going to go up in 0.3 grain increments from now on. Come on out of there, buddy. So the changes are gonna get a lot more minor. I should say. I literally can't see the, the impacts at all. <laughs> I, I really hope you guys can see the target. It's a uh, Kind of a weird feeling like you just have to assume you're hitting your point of aim because you can't see it <laughs> and it's not like hunting when it's like well it's either dead or it's not dead it's just like well i'm gonna keep shooting and then go down there and hopefully have a really good target can't be mad because i don't know if they're crappy groups and can't get excited because i don't know if they're good all i know is that i sighted it in and I am hoping for the best. So this next one is gonna be 26.3, no, 26.6. The last one was 26.3, as long as I'm looking at this right. We're gonna get through this very quickly. Oh my goodness. Well, I kind of saw holes on that one. So I know we're still like 
close enough to the point of impact that it's not a an issue per se um, we are on 26.9 grains on this next group here I need you guys to tell me if I'm doing good because I don't know. I just can't see it. Armor still look good. That's got me hopeful at least because we've had some weird stuff go on with 6.5 Grendel in the past. We might talk about that on another video. Interesting little cartridge. Somewhat new to it still. We'll say very new to it actually in a gas gun, but um, so far, I'm liking it actually quite a bit. I don't know. No, it's in there. I thought I saw that first piece of brass go flying but I don't know what that was it wasn't the brass obviously couldn't tell you what it'd be all right we're on to our last group here already <laughs> I can't believe we're actually gonna get through this I don't know if y'all can see anything but we're gonna get through it um, <clears throat> the last group that we're gonna be shooting here is They are sounding off like crazy. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if you guys could hear that or not. But the coyotes were going nuts in the direction that we are shooting. I'm not coyote hunting tonight, but I should be because they're vocal. That's cool. I don't, I doubt you guys could hear it, but if you could, I really hope you can hear that because that's, that's always really neat um, to me at least. So we're going to shoot this last group here. Hope to God you can see the target. I know I keep saying that, but. 27 and a half grains, 8208 XBR behind a 105 Sierra Blitz King. Let's get something good here. All right, well, I hope you guys can see the results if not, um, I may scrap this video and you may never see it. But other than that, um, I'll post pictures if, if there is enough um, going on here to even make a video out of it. But regardless, I'm going to show you all the sunset. There's a beautiful sunset. We're going to take a look at it together here. All right, so I'm trying to get to where I'm not totally blocking out to be here. This is this is what I call heaven for me. This is like my my perfect little slice of paradise, perfection, whatever you want to call it. Like this is as good as it gets. So thank you guys for watching the video for what it's worth. Um, I know I say that every time, but in all seriousness, it it is. Uh, it's very humbling when you actually have a lot of people that that will view this content and uh, especially when they give you know good feedback it's always appreciated so i don't take it for granted i'm, I'm grateful i'm very appreciative and i don't want that to go understated so 
Again, thank you guys for watching. If you are unaware, uh, please check out the website, the Facebook page, the Instagram, all that, yada, yada, yada. If you're watching this on YouTube, just check out the links in the description to see what other platforms you can see our content on if you are so interested and inclined to do so. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of this. We do a lot of it. And if you have any suggestions or feedback or anything that you can help me do to make this thing better, please feel free to share. Stay risen, take care, be safe, and we will hopefully see you next time, maybe with another beautiful sunset.